Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very cool surprise for you. So we are going to be doing a get ready with me, but I've asked a very special guest to join us. So please help me in welcoming my friend, Margaret. Good den. I am chirping Mary to be with thee this day. It could be a little quieter. Oh, just. Okay, so Margaret is from the 17th century and she is known throughout her village for her very healthful beauty. So she's going to tell us some of her secrets here today. So should we get started? Yes, we ought. First, I will don my Venetian ceruse to cover my pox scars. So it's like a, it's like a foundation. Yes. Very good. And you know, we love clean products oh. around here. So tell us, what's in your ceruse? It is mixed of water and vinegar. Oh, I love that. So natural and wholesome. Yes. And uh, powdered lead for lightening, as well as salt of boric acid. Wait, so. what? You'll want to really apply this thick as Tewksbury mustard, as hold, they say. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> First of all, I have no idea what Tewksbury mustard is. Oh, that is when you no, have that's okay. that's okay. Secondly, please do not put lead on your face or anywhere on your body for that matter. Um, now, Margaret. Yes. Uh, you can't tell my viewers to use this product. So please tell me you've got something else you can show us. Today. Of course, of course, of course. Um, <clears throat> so we, um, wait, you said no lead. No lead. So, no lead. Okay. Uh, th this. Uh, actually, now that I think about it, no. Oh, no, no, no. All right. That stipulation hath eliminated a goodly number of my cosmetics. Uh, oh, but I will share with thee my secrets for a complexion devoid of freckles. All right, I'm cautiously interested. So thou wilt need a goodly quantity of muriatic acid what did applied I, directly to thine visage. What did I just say oh, about acid? I am keen to thy worry. Now, will not the acid burn away my very flesh? <laughs> Fear not. For to remedy the burning, thou needst only apply a concoction of rotten milk and horse rack. All right, all right. I think we're finished today, guys. So next week, I'll have another video that doesn't include, you know, lead or acid. All right, Allison, do not be such an addle pot. Thou invited me here, but thou hast taken nary one of my suggestions for a smooth and radiant complexion. Okay, Margaret, I'm sure in your era, all these products are just fine, but modern people know that these are incredibly dangerous. Uh, well, can I not try one more time? All right, fine. All right. <laughs> but no lead. All right. Fine. Um, or acid. At thy wish. <laughs> or spoiled milk. On my oath. Okay, go ahead. All right. Today, I will show thee the route by which thou canst be perceived as a member of the queen's own court, using something thou assuredly already has in thy pantry. Oh, so it's a royal look, yes. and we love simple around here. <laughs> so thou wilt need to take a spent coal from thy hearth, so pulverize it, just crush it up really finely, and then apply it to thy teeth. So just really All right, all yeah. right, I think that we're finished here well, today. That's not even try it. No, 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 no. Uh, thank you all for watching. Next week's video, we'll have someone from the 21st century. And if thou needs me, thou can find me in the village of Glen Meadow. My hovel is the third one on the right. It's, it's the one with the pig shy out front. <laughs> okay, then thank you guys for watching. Take care.